This is the elevator at the furnace garage in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. It's a Schindler. Interesting indicators. Interesting floor indicators. Okay. I, I'm not sure if this is a 338 or 321A. We'll find out to make sure. That fan's annoying. That's a five. These are from 2005. Here we go. Let's see how this runs. Were that, was that a dry powered? Either way, that, epic, that motor is so epic. No, these are Schindler's. From 2005. Ooh. Kind of a rough stop. Actually, kind of in between. Back on the one. Sick chime. Are these dry power pumps? Just your basic parking garage elevator. Nothing fancy. HT vandal resistant. Hands free ADA code compliant phone. Capacity 3,500 pounds. Control panel. I wonder if these are super loud submersibles or these are dry powers. Ghost system crops an epic A fly motor. Where's the other machine? We're right here. Yeah, after I listen to this motor. No. Loud submersible. This is a this is another elevator. Interesting 500 day style indicators. Here's this one. Head five. These are both re leveled. Here we go. Pretty good beginning. This. It's my first time in here. My first impressions of the elevators uh, are basic, but they have some epic. They have some epic. Whoa. Whoa. In between the smooth and rough. In between. It takes forever to level. One. Wow. Stick. Six chimes. U.S. Steel Tower. Here we go. Just your basic parking garage elevator. Installed in 2005. Just like the other one. Schindler logo, which is mounted sideways for some reason. Look. Ooh. These are creep. These are uh, cleaner than the end got garage somewhat. No, wait. After there, there goes and that's it.